Hi, everyone. That was a pretty big hit of severe weather last evening, and the evidence is everywhere this morning. But I think it's more evidence of cicadas than thunderstorms. Stay with me here. Granted, the driving force behind the thousands of branches laden with dead leaves were thunderstorms and windswept rain. But social media has come alive with pictures of branches and yards area-wide. And that is because of female cicadas laying eggs. This from GardeningKnowHow.com. I'm quoting. Tree damage from cicada insects occurs during the egg-laying process. The female lays her eggs under the bark of a twig or branch. The twig splits and dies, and the leaves on the twig turn brown. This condition is called flagging. You can spot flagging twigs and branches at a glance because of the contrast of the brown leaves against the healthy green leaves on other branches. Female cicadas are particular about the size of the branch or twig where they lay their eggs, preferring those that are about the diameter of a pencil. This means that older trees won't sustain serious damage because their primary branches are much larger. Young trees, on the other hand, may be so severely damaged that they die from their injuries. So look around. Those thunderstorms last night turbocharged the next brood in 17 years. Nature unintentionally working together. Hashtag the circle of life. But what about the branches that have fallen on asphalt or concrete? Woe be to them. Now I feel guilty and feel it's my duty as part of that circle of life to toss those branches slash eggs in my yard to give those critters a chance to hatch, grow, and reemerge in 17 years. Guilt is a tough thing. I'm Marty Bass.